Hello, and welcome to a very special 30th episode edition of Let's Play Cortex Command. I'm Kelderan, and we're doing something a little bit different this time. It's been a while since we've played with mods, so we're going to go ahead and do that. Today we're playing with the Warhammer 40k mod, and in my time I've been known to play some Warhammer 40k, both tabletop and the uh, wonderful PC RTS games, uh, the Dawn of War series. So, uh, if you'd like to download this mod, and I suggest you do, the art is fabulous on it, uh, head over to the Data Realms forums and look in the mod section and pick up the uh, mod WH40K, Marines, Tau, Necron, Imperial Guard, and Orcs, and who knows, they may have even added more factions by the time you get around to it. There'll be a link in the show notes, so please, please don't comment with what mods are you using. Uh, with no further ado, let's go ahead and get started. I am playing the Tau, which is my uh, personal favorite. We are playing against the Space Marines, which will stomp on us every single day. The Necrons, which are the only ones that have a chance against the Space Marines. And finally, the Orcs. I've even changed up the colors a little bit to uh, kind of match the factions. No, the Orcs aren't green, because the Necron have the neat green weapons. But they're red, and everyone know Orcs think red is faster. So they're going to need to be able to beat us. So we'll start day one. We've got three loca oh, four locations opening up. So in a perfect world, we all get our own location. So... Oh, hell, we skipped our turn. <laughs> well, this isn't going well. Let's see who wins. It's Orcs versus Space Marines. No big surprise. Space Marines take it. The Necron take the uh, crazy, frozen, isolated Tundra. Eh, at least it's predictable. Uh, we get no money. It's our turn. Uh, caves or a mountain? I think I'm going to take the mountain because I think most of these Space Marines don't come with jetpacks. And that's something I want to uh, exploit. So we'll scan when we land. We'll end our turn and let's see what happens. Space Marines building actually quite a few defenses there. Uh, the Necron as well. I gave us slightly high. Oh no! Oh, I picked the very wrongest location. Oh well. Stops the uh, Space Marines from getting a location. Assuming I can kill the Space Marines, which is going to be a feat in its own. Uh, I'm, I haven't played the Tau yet in this uh, particular mod, so I'm going to just assume that not all of them have jetpacks, and I'm going to land up here. Uh, hopefully the high ground is more defendable. Now, a lot of these mods don't give you that uh, awesome little... Oh, okay. There is my brain. <laughs> He's just a brain with a Tau rifle, and nothing else, so he can't dig. Oh, no, and it's like a short-range one, too. <laughs> this isn't going to be good. Uh, two fire warriors. Yeah, that sounds about right. We'll go ahead and pick them up, drop them over here. Uh, what else do we have? Uh, enough money for... That's a stealth suit. I don't think we can... No, we can afford a crisis suit. And, uh... Well, we'll see if we need it first. We'll, uh... We'll not pick that up. These guys... They do not... Oh, nope. They don't have jetpacks. So I'm going to try to keep them up here on the mountain as sort of a, uh... Forward guard. Uh, wow. Does their weapon have a different mode? Because this is just terrible. Yeah, that's really low range, which doesn't feel right for a, uh... Does it just only fire when someone's close by, or...? So it looks like it will shoot longer range, I just don't know how to... <laughs> how to make that work. Oh. Alright, so... We're just going to go for it. Hopefully by the time we end up with uh, enemies, we'll figure out how to do this. Oh, okay, so we kind of shot him with our <laughs> with our terrible lasers. Go, terrible lasers. I'm sure there's some way I'm supposed to be doing this, but until I figure it out, this is just going to be hilarious. Pistol. Oh, oh, yeah, let's do this. You want to go, buddy? You want to go? There. Ha! Okay, so we've taken out one brain. Uh, that's a shooter, so that had to have been the orcs I took out. Alright, that works. Uh, I don't need a chopper because... Oh, it's a big shooter! <laughs> Screw that, I'm going to take this big weapon over here. Especially since I don't have a jetpack anyway. Ooh, that's... Hey, it looks like the Space Marines got taken out. So who's left? The Necron. Of course the Necron are left. Who else would be left? Uh, do I have enough... I do have enough money to buy this battle suit. And that's kind of tempting. I'm kind of disappointed they don't have the crew in here. Let's see if I can take them out with a battle suit. That'd be kind of nice. It looks like none of them have uh, digging tools, and I can't tell if I really like that or really don't like that. 
Because part of me says, all right, you know, the enemy won't just do its much finer digging than me, than I. Uh, oh no, I, there's got to be a way to make that range higher. Although I like that he flies. Uh, okay, so that's that weapon. That's the only weapon he has. Oh, he actually flies too. Like I can stop in midair. Oh, so the bullets are actually going that far. It's just got like tracer shots that don't go that far. Alright, speaking of... Nope, nope, nope. Nope, that's not gonna happen today, buddy. Just gonna rain down death on him for a little bit to see if that helps. Alright, uh, let's use our greater mobility to try and get in on this commander. And here we are. Ow, that commander has a lot of health. But it's okay, so does our... Uh, here we go, we got him. So does our battle suit, and we start this uh, particular map off with a battle suit. I love it! So that makes a lot more sense now that I know... That the range is, in fact, how the Tau are in the tabletop game and otherwise, with a lot of range and a lot of firepower, but a little bit squishy until you pay the big bucks for a battle suit. And you know what? I think we're going to do that in the future. Uh, we'll go ahead and get some money from, uh, well, we'll pay Tradestar the 200 that we magically have to pay them. Uh, we'll get our 1000 back, which is really handy. And I'm kind of tempted to just go ahead and put defenses here. No, yeah, because if we don't put defenses here, we're going to be in a world of trouble uh, come later on. And we've got that nice big mountain area already occupied. So let's do that. Alright, so income has been counted. Uh, it doesn't look like the orcs are doing well, which was kind of to be, you know, expected. Uh, oh, expedition. No, 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 no. We're going to stay here. We're going we're gonna to go ahead and just let the... No, we'll design the base. We'll give ourselves... Uh, we'll say about a thousand to design with. Let's go. Alright, so here's our brain. That's nice. And we want to make a bunker. Hmm, that's bunker backgrounds. There we go. So I think... I think I'm going to keep it kind of simple. I want something over our heads. Uh, to keep us from being bombarded on top. And for that, I'm going to go ahead and do these. So this will give us some nice sort of footholds to hang out in. Put my brain in the very middle, maybe put him in between a couple of, uh, eh, you know, defensive barriers. And for the top, we still do want snipers up there, or at least something. So let's see, uh, bumper odds and ends, or rather bunker odds and ends. I like this right here. Uh, that sort of gives us something we can climb up on and shoot over the edge. And I think I might put that on the other side if they have them. That doesn't look like they do. Unless I can flip it? Nah. Okay, so it's not like actors. What else do we have here? We've got... Uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for that. What about modules? No, no. Bunker bits? Here we go. Let that sort of hang out a bit there so we can shoot stuff above us if they try to, like, come in from different and weird angles. Uh, sort of what this is doing here as well. Uh, otherwise, I think we want to start buying troops. Head down to the Tau section here. We've got Tau drones. Oh, that's kind of neat. Tau uh, drone snipers. I do like that. I can't help but think that the Tau uh, snipers are going to be a little bit... Or rather, the drones are going to be a little bit soft and squishy. So, stealth guy. I kind of want to put a stealth guy way down here to just uh, cause havoc. Yep, put a stealth guy down there. Uh, that'll be handy. And we've got our Tau Fire Warriors all about the place. A battle tech guy there. And for fun, we will do this lap. No, I think that's it. And I think that's within our spending. No, we'll put a sniper drone up here and that will be it. Uh, that's within our spending limit. We need to move our brain before I forget. Uh, place brain. He's going to be right there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's going to build in the order that you see it all shining up. I, so I learned something about uh, building mode. You place things, and it will attempt to buy them with the money you put in, in the order that you place them. So all the way over here, buy those things, buy this thing, come down, buy the stealth trooper. So it may not build our sniper drone if we don't have enough money, but I think everything else we do have enough money for. So with no further ado, let's finish our base designing and see if we get attacked. We'll go ahead and end our turn. 
And cool, looks like we were under our spending limit, which means we have enough money roughly for another battle suit. Although maybe not the amount of money to drop the battle suit. Uh, so we'll see. I think if we get attacked, we've got a pretty good... Nope, nope, everyone's going for the caves. Uh, which is fine. I'm sure the, the Space Marines will nab it, and we'll have to go after them next. Yep. Okay, so Space Marines are our next target, which is scary. They're so hard to kill. Uh, it's day four, or we can take the new location. Hmm. Well, we get some money. It's our turn. I don't think we need to put much more money there. Actually, I don't think we need to put any money there. We're going to put everything into attacking these Highlands. Uh, this should be enough for us to both attack, buy ourselves a nice battle suit, and go, uh, go wipe shit crazy. My favorite kind of crazy. So we will end our turn and uh, see what happens. Sure enough, all except for the Necron attack, which is sort of an interesting turn of events. Let's see who they, uh, who they think the weakest link on the map is. The uh, two Space Marines or myself. Admittedly, the Necron commander did do a pretty good bang-up job on my, uh, on my battle suit. I like this location right here. It gives me that defensive wall with uh, some nice range shooting over there. So let's go ahead and drop our brain right here. And see where our enemies decide to go. Okay, so the orcs are pretty close by. I'm going to go ahead and pick up two fire warriors. We're going to tr try them again. Actually, we have a Pathfinder with a Sniper Drone. And a Fire Warrior with a Pulse Digger. Wouldn't that be Earthcast? Just saying. Alright, so you've got a jetpack. That's kind of... Oh, no. Oh, no, you don't. Go, hurry up and burst out of your shells, you bastards. Uh, you. You, you, you. Start killing him. Kill, 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 kill. There we go. Okay. Uh, do you fly, or do you just kind of float around awkwardly? Okay, you kind of do fly, but it's... <laughs> it's a disappointing excuse for flight. Ooh! That was spinny. Uh, well, it looks like he hovers, which is interesting. Ooh, ooh, nope, 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 nope. I, ooh, actually, he's, uh... The drone's size appears to be... Oh, I was going to say advantageous, but I got shot down. Alright, so... All of our enemies appear to be to our right. Looks like the Space Marines made short work of the Orcs, which was no one's big surprise here. So what can we buy to turn the tables? That's a clone. Doesn't do us much good. Can we do a uh, single Fire Warrior? Doesn't look like it. Uh, fire Warrior Squad Leader. Be interested to see what that's all about. Let's go ahead and pick him up. Ah, not enough money. Okay, so we are going to need a digger here. Uh, wow, we don't have enough money for that either. Okay, so uh, we're super expensive. Uh, we'll stop that, see if our one Tau Warrior can get the deed done. And if not, I'm going to evac my brain. I don't know that it's going to make that big of a difference. But if I can get away with not having to uh, spend a brain, then I think I will. Although, it does leave us in a weird predicament when we uh, will then be two sites behind these Space Marines. I don't want to be two sides behind, even if they are Space Marines. Although this does give us a new challenge. Uh, before, we had been winning a little bit more than I would have cared to, uh, even with the amount we've played and stuff. And I think the Space Marines give us the challenge we need, and holy cow, playing this game without jetpacks is a challenge on its own. Come on, come on, buddy. It's not made of glue. I'm not glue. Uh, slippery substance of your choice, number three. All right, come on. Jump forward. Oh, this is just getting ridiculous. All right, buy menu. We're going to buy ourselves a cheap drone. And here we go, buy menu. Get rid of those. Actually, let's go to the bodies. What if we can get a drone with a digging utensil on top? Uh, oh, oh, four brains under attack. Who is attacking our brain? What is that all about? <laughs> I think he had a gun and a chainsword out. And that's just kind of freaking ridiculous. So, it looks like we've lost a location to the Marines. And, uh, yep. Yikes. Oh, good. And the, uh, the Necron are attacking the Space Marines. Let's see who comes out ahead here. Come on, Necron. Nope, Space Marines keep it. Alright, so we're gonna 
end it right here for this episode. Next time on Let's Play Cortex Command Warhammer 40k mode. Uh, we'll see if we can't get leverage on these damn space marines. Next time.